So MCON was like the first place we like came together in real life. It's like wild to see so many people uh, part of DAOs. It's like insane. And I think we're at a different stage of asking like, how do we operate these DAOs? How do we like, you know, like actually take it from like, we've gone from zero to one. How do we take it from one to 10? How do we bring it to more people? It's actually all of us against Moloch. It's all of us against our own inability to coordinate. And so the game is not, how do I make my team, you know, beat your team? It's how do we get like more teams working together. These communities are just a natural way that we've come together on the internet to create value. Now they have a bank account, now they have a cap table. Let's go do some cool things with it. A school of fish move together in unison, in harmony, point at the same direction, but there's no one person that leads it. There's a whole bunch of people who are leading together. There are a lot of things that are not scalable unless they come from the community, making it so anyone, anywhere can also build amazing experiences. We fund products that solve problems that we have. These DAO toolings, right, for helping basically take DAOs into the real world, that's like a real opportunity space. We don't talk about the implications of what it means to literally create another world that is running parallel with us. It was very emergent. Like we had a value system, we had like things that we knew, knew that we wanted to do, but like the long-term vision was very open-ended and we just wanted to make sure that we were getting dope people in the door. We're talking more about like this intrinsic sort of like belonging to a community and you start actually valuing that because that doesn't just represent like a coin of a thing that represents the time that you and effort you spent. We have leaned so heavy into our, into our set of memes. It works as uh, as a mimetic filter. I do see service DAOs as a great entry point for, for people like me who have these skills to offer to the space, um, but there might not be a clear cut path. The tangible experience is an important one, and it's, a, it's a, actually a great red pill for this very ephemeral technology based thing that we're all kind of creating. There's the Metagamma Delta uh, mix at 4 p.m. somewhere on the internet, you can find details. The shapeshift like uh, mini golf thing. Urban putt. Yeah, some somewhere on the internet as well. You can find details. There's also um, future swap, why drinks, uh, find the links. Yeah, Telegram. yeah, just like you don't just drop into the space and drop a banger and everyone gives you a million dollars. Like you have to get into the space, you have to learn solidity and that's like the top of the Dunning-Kruger. You feel like you can do anything you want, but really you need to go through this tour of duty. This is critical infrastructure for DAOs, is like yeah. to have people actually meet in person. You can't get the same feeling in Discord. You can make forks of certain codes, but it's really, really, really hard to make an exact copy of an, another ecosystem, another organization. I just keep wondering, once all of the coordination is figured out, what are we coordinating for? So I'm an open source maximalist, and, and so like copy what we're doing and take what we're doing for open source software and bring it to journalism and like privacy preservation and create this like fractal innovation and coordination technology that will uh, hopefully expand outwards into the world. We want to make sure that we're building this like decentralized future that we've been talking about to include all types of people. None of these ideas are new and people have been, you know, trying to tackle them for a very, very long time. So. Yeah, we have like new tools to tackle how to become more human. Carrying on this like collaborative, positive sum, multiplayer game, and we can all kind of LARP together. It is coordination all the way down. That's everything, right? And if we can figure out better ways to work together, better ways to trust each other, then that solves everything for us.